Well, good evening. How's everybody doing? You are well. Um, I'm Loxley. I am a VTuber. I am playing uh, Monster Train, which is what I've been doing for the last few streams, but I'm just really enjoying it. Plus, every time I play, I kind of get a little bit more unlocked, and hey, that's a lot of fun. Um, or, like, just as a pure example, the other day I unlocked the Umbra, which I've not played before, so we're going to jump straight into a game playing with them. Um, very much looking forward to this. I, like, this is the, like, the one thing I know about these guys is that they have the, um, the, the morsel cards, which have been referenced. This is the first time I'll actually have them in hand. Um, but yeah, Penumbra. Oh, wow. They, it, Penumbra is very strong, uh, and I love the whole spidery aesthetic. It's great. Uh, so you have, yeah, you have six arms, two legs. Very spider. Commune with the ancient Umbra Shroud. The original presence of hell. Mine the crucible for precious materials to help in the fight against Seraph. I'm really curious what these guys do. I have no idea. I'm going to jump straight on Covenant Rank 1. Um, I'm not bothering with Rank 2 because that just adds dead weight. Actually, that being said, last time I did this, I did get a card which basically improves strength based on purging stuff in your deck or, or um, bad cards that exist in your deck. Do you know what? Let's let's try it. It'll slow the deck down a little, but this seems to the sp the shade splitter seems to kind of change that up a little. So yeah, go for it. Let's let's try it. Let's try Covenant level two. Okay, so. Prismal Dust, apply one times... Ooh, damage shield's quite good. Uh, add three uncommon or rare morsel units to your hand. Cannibalize. Kill a friendly unit to play this card. Ooh, Seraph the Diligent. diligent. Uh, ooh, you are a bastard. And also Energy Siphon. Apply spell weakness one to any, an, an enemy unit. Okay, so two from the Umbra, one from the... One from Tethys Lot. Cool. Let's try it. Upgrade my champion. Absolutely. Ooh. Ooh. So you can either increase the capacity of the floor or you just get trample and are massive. Oh, you are going to be fascinating to play with. Um, but actually, I'm going to start out with this one. And then we'll get some... Concussive coal, coals, 50% chance to apply dazed when a unit enters your train, or incant abilities trigger an additional time. I don't think I have anything that has incant inherently, so I'd rather have something that's going to be potentially useful straight from the off, so let's go for the dazed. And what do we got in here? So we've got a conscription notice, first summon a champion, gain a random unit card. Random is... Uh, uh, ooh, cards in reward packs and unit banners come with a random upgrade. That, wait, what? Units cost minus two, wait, what? Um, yes, absolutely, every time. That's, so basically every, is everything in my deck now free? Yes, everything in my deck is now free. Well, a lot of things in my deck are free. Oh, I only get one dead weight, I thought it was three. Weird. Um, that's fine. So Energy Siphon and then Frozen Lance is quite good. These are free, so awesome. We're going to have an interesting start. Uh, wow, your threat level is quite high straight away. Uh, foot shoulders the hit of the Disciples of Seraph. Weak attackers in the back lines, take them down. Ah, yes, Disciple Foot Shoulder behind the Protector. Uh, oh, and you add weight of contrition. Um, enemy units enter with armor 10. I'm going to say no, because I actually haven't that much that's going to do direct damage. Uh, and you enter days. That's kind of cool. Uh, right. Pop you in there. Um, let's apply a damage shield to... Oh, wait, no. Let's do that last, because I don't want that many shields. I do, however, want 
Let's see what this does. What is a morsel? A rebel morsel. Eaten. After the next round of combat, this unit will be eaten by the front unit without an eaten ability. Oh, so game one, eater gains plus... Okay, sure. You seem kind of fun. Oh, also again, that this this Forever Flame is going to be fascinating to play with. Um, I apologize if you heard my Discord bidoop then. For, uh, I shouldn't actually be doing that. I'm pretty sure I have my notifications off. But I have no honest clue where that sound came from. Uh, do I have my notifications to take off? I mean, evidence would suggest not. Uh, ah, sounds for message. I've got my desktop notifications off. I've not got my sounds for message off. That was silly. Oh, we're on that one. Uh, where are you? What's up? Quiet, quiet, quiet. Ah, uh, it's VTubing. You expect a degree of scuff. It's fine. It's fine. At least it's right at the start where I can fix when I can fix it without too much fuss and hassle. Um, right. So that's spell weakness one, and presumably it will. Uh. Next, oh, next time it's hit by a damage spell. Okay, let's do that then, and then we will do Prismal Dust on you, so you've got a bunch of damage. And yeah, end turn. And you get a bit more powerful because you get a... Nice. Uh, damage to front enemy. That sounds like a good plan. Let's put that there. You in the front there. You behind. And again, you're all free. Um. Oh, and now you're full. Uh, okay, well, let's pop you behind here. And you're not going to do a huge amount of damage. That did waste a bit of an annoyance, but not too bad. Okay, enter. Ah. Except I now have nobody on the top floor. Ah, that's a problem. Uh, sacrifice. Add three uncommon or rare morsel units to your hand. Well, I guess that's what we're... Morsel Excavator. Lifesteal. Ooh. Hi. Hi, friend. Uh, we serve. And cannibalize. You know what? I'm a... Let's risk it. Let's risk it. Bye. Oh, hello. Eater gains plus six. Eater gains plus six. Eater gains. You know what? This might actually be. So, that gets rid of you. You're no longer an issue. Um, you get more damage. You get more health. Actually, you should go there. Um, in fact, two of you. And... You know what, let's see if we can weaken things right at the start. Uh, oh, I could have put this thing uh, on this floor just to get it, but then it wouldn't have been eaten. And I feel eating things is going to be the way to go. Nice. Okay. Morsel. Uh, Morsel. And this is the end of turn. At the end of the next round of combat. I think this will work. Um, I have been told that you can actually just get away without ever needing... Um, without doing anything for this first fight. So, we'll see how that works. Uh, oh yeah, that's a pain. Oh, and now we win. Okay. Ah, yes, because you have lifesteal now, and you're going to be quite powerful, so... Okay, interesting. So, morsel heavy... So you almost don't want too much. So, apply lifesteal for an ember train 2 to a friendly unit. Oh, so that's a really shitty trade. Uh, that's for more damage shield. Fly Rage and Ember Drain, but gain three. Okay, interesting. 
might just take it. I might take it to the Prismal Dust. That damage shield's kind of nice. I want three of them, though. I'm not sure I'd... Yeah, you know what? Let's take that for the time being. I can always purge it later. Mollusk Mage. Draw one, discard one. Plus ten magic power on this floor. You know what? Yeah, why not? Like, if I'm going to do a bit of uh, consumption and spell run. Um, so I should probably do, like, Merchant of Magic first, honestly. But I am really curious what I have... You know, let's have some filtering here. I don't really want the stewards to stick around still, I don't think. Um, so getting more Stygian units would be a good idea. Merchant of Magic. Let's go for the Merchant of Magic. Forgotten Boons. And what do you want to do? Uh, upgrade a spell to gain Permafrost. Ah, spell costs less. So... Probably not a bad shout. Yeah, go for it. Um, does this... Yeah, there's nothing I really want to attach that to. Um, is there anything in here that I really want to have desperately? No. I'm going to quickly re-roll. Upgrade a spell to remove consume. Ooh, ah, right. So that was a good idea to get this because I can add more damage shield... And I don't lose the consume. So actually, not too fussed about the Eternal Stone. Um, anything else that's massively expensive? Not really. And magic power? I'll do that. Okay, that's... I'm okay with that then. Um, let's have a bit of a play with the Divine Temple. See if there's anything here. Spell Chain. What does that actually do? Copy this card will be added to hand. The card costs plus one and gains Purge. Or upgrade a spell with 10 magic power and piercing. Can I do that? Uh, only to the frozen lances. Eh. Engage in a pack. Sacrifice a unit to infuse its essence into another unit. I mean, one thing I do... Yeah, let's sacrifice a train steward and stick it into the mollusk mage. Yeah. You know what? I, I like the mollusk mage to be a little bit more powerful. So why not? Ooh. Ooh, I like your... I never thought before. Is that like a permanent thing on you now? Let's train. Ah, yeah, so it has got like a little bit of a thing. Interesting. Um, don't know how, how long this run's going to be if I'm going to be... I'm already at 40. Oh, dear me. Um, so you just got... You're not that bad. Incant is going to be a bastard. Uh, recover. You're going to restore stuff. Plus... I don't think that's too bad. Ah, let's risk it. Bit of early hubris, just to have a bit of a warm-up. Oof. Uh, right, pop you there. Uh, pop you right behind. Uh, ooh, bit more... Yes, I like that. So you take a lot of damage. Oh, but you're also in Cant. Uh, that is a shame. But you know what? Actually, doesn't matter because now you're not going to do any damage. And we're going to kick your ass. Um, wait, why are you going to lose 24 health? Because you're... Oh, you have Trample. Wait, no. What? You don't have Trample. Why are you going to take damage? Why are you going to... I don't understand. Okay, I'm confused. I'm not going to complain. Oh, sorry, you have 25 damage and 20 power. Never mind. That's that's why. Um, okay. Let's pop you there. I'm going to keep you for the time being, because I really don't want to... Hello, Midgeworth! Thank you very much for joining us this evening. Uh, yes, we're playing Monster Train. I, I kind of fell in love with this very recently. It's a lot of fun. And, uh, yeah, I've just been... Having a wonderful time with it. Oh, you're all dazed, so you're not actually going to attack. That's quite good. So you'll take 35 damage. Actually, that means you can probably... I can probably boost this quite well. So you take that. Um, do I want to cannibalize anything? I should have put that, en I should have put that uh, energy siphon in front. Hmm... 
No, uh, no, I don't want to sacrifice anything. I don't want to sacrifice you. Actually, you're going to get 50 gold. That's not really worth it. Let's get rid of you. At an umbra. Ooh, Morsel gains health. Not the most useful thing, but you know what? Let's make you a little bit more tanky. And we'll see what happens. Uh, do you want to... Why not? And... Let's see how that works. How are you doing this evening, Midgeworth? Hope you're doing well. Roof for spite. Wonderful. Uh, ooh, that's a shame. Um, okay, we've got a morsel. Eater gains. Ooh, three damage shield. Yes, thank you. Um... I'll do, and... Oh, I don't have enough ember for that one. Well, let's really hope this works. Uh, yeah, that'll work. That's... None of you are dying, which is... I've not got any anything that's sweepy at the moment, which is a little bit of a shame. Um, so we'll keep an eye on that and see how it... Oh, final wave already. Good lord, who would have thought? Uh, right... Well, Shade Splitter sounds like a good plan. Shade Splitter sounds like a wonderful plan. Uh, Eater Gains and Life Steal. You've only got 8 damage. Not terrible. Oh, wait, hang on. This might do... No, that will do... Oh, that'll leave you with 1 health. Um, let's pop you up here. Uh, you'll still... Oh, that is annoying. That being said, you'll do a fair amount of damage to the pyre, which I'm not really sure I want. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, let me see. So that will do some good work. That being said, actually, if I pop you just there, you'll... Ah, and actually, I can just cannibalize you straight away. To have, yeah, pop you there. Pop you there. Why are not? Why are you not? Oh no! This one at the back is now gonna be fine. Um. Okay. Well, let's try here and here, and then we'll throw a frozen lance at you. I don't think we're doing great. I think we can... Oof. Okay, so you're down to... Hmm, Mollusk made pretty well. Oof. That was painful. I don't usually use my... Use my uh... Okay, what do we got? What do we got? Right. Weakness. Weakness. Frozen Lance. Uh, uncommon Morsel. Oh, wow, you're not taking any damage. That's, uh, that is a, that's the entire thing. I probably should have put that Morsel on the uh, floor above, really. Oh, it's because you're only doing five and then you heal. What are you? You're relentless. Mm. Okay. Okay, so this has not been the best start. You've seen this game, just never got it. You never got it as in never owned it or never... Um, or just not understanding the uh, appeal. Out of curiosity. Ooh, that was not my best effort. Number of salts. Add one, un two, sorry. Add two uncommon or rare morsel units to your hand. Nice. That's ornamental trade, not great. Gem trove. Apply damage shield, one to friendly units. Add three uncommon 
So good, but really expensive. I'm more inclined to go for this, actually, because you can probably... Oh, actually, that's really good for getting rid of the low-level rubbish at the back. Ooh, Triton's Gratitude. Or I could go for another... Mo I'm, I'm not really... I don't really have a huge number of actual cards, so another... Another BC is probably not a bad shout. Ooh, and hello. So, Gorge Gain Lifesteal. Ah. Morsel Maker, Summon an, an Untumbra Morsel and a Magma Morsel. Ooh, that's kind of fun. And Name of Siren. This, like, Lifesteal is quite useful. Okay, let's try... So we've got Umbra Banner, Restore 20... That might actually need to do that one. Um, would like to get a Hawk. Yeah, 25, going into a boss. Not happy with that. So let us go and get a card. What do I want to have more of? I probably want more... Honestly, free Calibralize is a pretty good because the morsels that uh you can hit you can hit with a look uh, while you play some games absolutely oh, absolutely man thank you very much for popping by i really do appreciate it that was the <laughs> well you know to be honest i got i i was gonna say is like i i quite like the community you you have brought around you and yeah i'm i'm kind of happy that i met you and a few of the other folks in that in that server uh with and so yeah it makes sense i'm kind of it's nice to be part of a be part of a group and yeah I, I it's a cool looking it's a cool looking gift so yeah thank you for making it uh let's restore pyre health and let's see what's in the concealed caverns Ooh, not seen this one before Pillar of light spews strange fragments into the air, making the way ahead dangerous. The bone shaker grinds to a halt on its own, perhaps recognizing the odd power emanating from the pillar. The air is stale, imperceptible even, no longer stinging with the outer chill, but also devoid of life entirely. You feel the urge to hold your hand to the light, unsure of what may occur, but something on the back of your mind urges caution. Oh, but the light does beckon. And do you listen? I feel it calling, so infuse Nexus Spike with the essence of two spells. What does this do? Consume does not affect bosses. I don't understand what it does. Something's not right. Purge your spell, create three copies with unhinged power. Reduce to zero and apply purge. Oh, okay. Wait, hang on. So this just adds consume. No, infuse Nexus Spike with the essence of two spells understand what's going on here oh does that mean it does two things purchase spell create copies with unhinged power so if there's any spells i want to get rid of let's have a look i don't think i need two energy siphons oh no it's purging a spell you know what let's get rid of some frozen lances yeah some part of your subconscious wills you away from the light. It is powerful but unknown. Tossing some of your own power into the pillar fragments it into smaller pieces, imbuing each one with some of the light within. Interesting. Uh, 30 magic power, magic power and piercing. I don't think there's anything that I... Ooh, wait, hang on. Actually, True Stone and Extreme Stone on At a Number Assault actually suddenly sounds like quite a fun idea. Yes, 43 damage with a Slay option. 
And you know what? Let's let's pop uh, another train steward into a mollusk mage. Look at a shy guy. Uh ooh, wow, okay. <laughs> so threat level, yes. Talos, the architect of the Exodus, attacks blindly and gains more protection with each unit she slays. Enemy units enter with rage two. That's not fun. That being said, I'm thinking I'm looking at this at the from the wrong perspective. Enemy units enter with rage two. But that'll go down by two. So actually, what I want to do with this deck. You know what? We're going to work a little bit top down here. Yeah, because if I start to... Oh, I can throw another one at you. Uh, I'll throw one at you. Yeah, probably. Check you there. Okay, let's try this. Because what I'm thinking... You'll get Life Stealer. You'll go on a different floor. But you can actually start to gain life steal. You can start to gain power. It's gonna be a bit slow, but let's give this a shot. Wait, why did you start with rage three? Why do you have rage three? Uh, ooh, hello. So we can actually. Perfect. Let's pop you here. So I'm really curious whether this gets eaten by the Crucible Collector or by the Penumbra, depending on the position. Um, I don't really want to... Actually, you know what? Let's... Pop you in here, and then we're just going to sacrifice you straight away. Um, these will all get used in time. But at some point, like, this thing at the front will get punched and die. So, yeah, we'll give this a shot. Ah, so the front one did eat it. Okay, so now you don't have any... So you'll go down, you'll go down. Ooh, hello. I could actually... So I don't want to... So let's play that. Let's play... That. And then I have two, which lets me... Mid shield. Ah, you hit twice. That's fine. You know what? You'll still gain a bunch of lifesteal. That's absolutely fine. Nice. So actually, those defensives are going to do pretty well. Uh, we don't want the Mollusk Mage on this floor. Let's pop you behind the Train Steward and the Mollusk Mage. Uh, I would rather you not go down, so let's get rid of you, get rid of you, what are we going to do here, and then, yeah, you know what, let's pop you there, damage shield there, Oh, it feels a bit weird playing top down. But that's fine. I'm actually okay with this. It's this works pretty well. Uh Can I make it so you get more damage? Possibly. No, you're too big. Uh okay, let's get rid of you. And now you're going to go down. Do it again. You nearly go down. Um, I could probably put a morsel in. Um, uh, unfortunately you don't get any... Oh, you're gonna... Why are you gonna go down? Why are you gonna die? Oh, because you'll get eaten, presumably. Uh, pop you here, and then... 
Oh, damage shield on you. That was not useful because all of you are going to go. That's fine. Ah, was one of you a sweeper? Ah. You go down. Ah, go away. Can I get... Ooh, possibly. Uh, so you gain a bit more health and lifesteal. You'll gain... Ah, we don't have enough stuff. Right, okay. Well, that's a good start. What we really want to do... Well, start with that, and then we'll pop... Which of these do I want to sacrifice? Pop you there. Pop you there. Pop you there. Are you a sweeper? Yes, you're a sweeper. You're annoying. Fine. Oof. Ow. Okay. So, I don't think this has gone wildly well. So much so that I think this may actually be the end of the run. But, I think, you sweep? No, so you're going to get eaten. Okay, we'll see how this works. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you tank the pyre, so... This ends here, but that's okay, because ultimately I kind of wanted to know what was going on. Oh wow, that did not bring anything particularly high. Enemies killed by the pyre. Ow. Uh, okay, that's absolutely fine. Um... I might turn Covenant off for this, just while I'm getting used to it, because I want to see if how, how far I can get. So, let's do that. I'd rather kind of have a little bit more... To be fair, I probably piled on the Covenant... You know what, let's, let's stay with Covenant Rank 1. At that point, like, the dead weight does not do anything. You know what, yeah, I'm going to do the same thing again, but I'm not going to go so heavy on the... So, Amber Cash. Consume as three excavated Ember cards. Ooh. So just bonus. Consume to plus thing on the floor. Nice. And Helical Crystal. Okay, cool. Two of those. Like, might get rid of those later. These are good. This is good. Ooh. Uh, right. We've got 50% chance. Spells with consume might be discarded. Units cost minus two. Like, that's just amazing. Uh, Dark Forge, upgrade my champion. I have Life Stealer, Gorge plus four, and ooh, that we like. I think that'll be quite a nice one. Um, do I want to get? There's already Divine Horde here. Divine Temple. I'm going to say, let's get Divine Temple and Divine Temple. That would be what? I think I can get most of the forging done that I need in order to, in those final ones, because the temples just allow you to do a bunch of stuff. Um, so yeah, you know what? I'm going to... I think just because the threat becomes so heavy in this first artifact might be fun though you know what if the artifact's gonna be fun i'm gonna go through the divine horde first i'm gonna go through the divine horde in the first circle rather than anything else non-boss enemy units enter with spikes three pass Right, let's get through the first the first uh, three circles first. Oh, that'll be 
quite nice. Yeah. Um, pop you there. So you're not going to take any damage. Ah, because you've got lifesteal and you're only doing two damage. <laughs> nice. I approve. Frozen Lance. And you know what? I'm probably going to want the Space Prism on this floor. Okay, so let's have a shifty. Ah, so I can get lots of these. Cool, okay. Pop you there. Um, get rid of you two. And now you're going to have trouble. Um, let's get a morsel. Pop you there. Because now you'll take... In fact, you'll get plus three. Because um, you're going to eat... And you know what? We're going to keep this rolling. So, probably a little bit of a thing on here. Oh, perfect. Those come quite nicely. Uh, let's put another strange steward up here. And a minion. And a minion. No, morsel, morsel, sorry. It uh, doesn't matter where you go, you're going to be eaten by the Penumbra. <laughs> Bailey Legend of Zelda-ish uh, theme here. I quite like it. This will not be the end for me. Ooh, oh, okay. You're, you, you are quite a, quite a beast, aren't you? Okay, let's see how how hilariously overpowered you can become. Um, and we'll just... Yeah, why not? I'm kind of curious what happens. So, I'm going to slow this down quickly. So, ah, so that was just a damage shield. You did a little bit of damage. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> One punch. One punch! You know what? The... This, when this got boosted, was a lot of fun. I'm gonna go for that. Flash freeze. Ooh, frostbite's a lot of... Uh, frostbite I like. Um, offering token. Dura one, discard one. Hmm. Not sure. I mean, I don't need to do this. This is free. I mean, the Frostbite, actually 8 damage, then 7 damage, progressive, is actually pretty good. Yeah, let's go for that. Like, the Frostbite is really good. Um, and I'm not too fussed about the Umbra Banner. Instead, as I have this, the, the, the Antumbra Assault. Yeah. These probably aren't actually going to be got rid of now, I think about it. Um, what I really want is upgrade a spell with 10 magic power. That sounds good. Upgrade a spell to, re uh, to remove, consume, and cost one. I don't think I have anything that's being... Ooh, I do. Space Pism might be an idea for that one. Um, anything that can make much cheaper? Ooh, zero for... Three zeros. Yeah, let's... Or maybe Frostbite. Wait, that's going to come around every time. That's fine. Uh, cool. Quickly, I'm just going to quickly grab this uh, money. And then... That's actually not as useful for consumption. To removal. Because then at some point you just end up with... Actually, it's been said it's... More and more draw, plus more and more... Oh! Hello! Thank you very much, your liege. Welcome, welcome, to, the, welcome to the course. Uh, thank you very much for the follow, I appreciate it. I hope you're having a very nice day. Um, 
add three excavated amber card as draw one, gain two. Sure, I think that basically lets me <laughs> hype. I don't know that one. Ah, I see. Ah, that's mi that's one of the midges hype hype things. I thought I recognised it. Uh, let's re-roll and upgrade a spell with another ten magic power. Twenty-three. Yes, that sounds good. Keepstone. Ah, I would have done it on that, but uh, that's a shame. Ah well. Uh, minus one. Yeah, put minus one on you. How are you doing, your liege? How are you? I hope you're having a good evening. And you know what? I, as long as you have at least 25 gold, lose 25 gold when you take higher damage in combat instead of taking damage. Interesting. Enemy units get minus one or gorge abilities trigger an additional time. You're doing okay? Hope to wrap up work in the next hour. I hope you do too. In the meantime, uh, you know, you're more than welcome to just hang out here and uh, enjoy. I'm currently playing uh, Monster Train, which is just a deck, roguelike deck builder that I've absolutely fallen in love with. Um, oh, hello. Getting uh, buzzes off Twitter Going on a different place. Um, I think this is kind of fun because I've already got a gorge ability on my Penumbra. Gorge plus, that's plus eight, plus four. Yeah, we're going to do that. We're going to do that. Monster Train is great. Needs to play more of it myself. I, to be honest, I really, I've thought it's been fun. It's been really good to stream the last week or so. Um, and yeah, I'm just kind of slowly unlocking things and just enjoying myself immensely and kind of learning. Like, there's so much. There's so much in this. You can, like, you can see it's a real labor of love. And unit draft. Sure, why not? Let's 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 risk it for a biscuit. Enemy units enter with armor ten. Yep, that's fine. Like everything to this about this game is just so good. You've got beautiful music. You've got brilliant designs. You've got somebody pointed out that there's there is lore in ev on et attached to every single card, and I'm just like, okay, there is that is a lot. There's a lot to deal with. You there pop you there pop you there you can have all of the frostbites <laughs> plus 17 oh dear this is this is gonna get silly very quickly oh, i do appreciate the games where it's just like hmm this is going to be ridiculous enjoy your frostbite bye What have we got? Uh, let's do that. Uh, I can't do that one. That's a shame. Um, if I throw this at you. Ugh, you're still only going to lose 12. That's annoying. Fine, you get to run away with your money. If you bust. You go there. Another morsel. Ooh, damage shield as well. Uh, let's put some excavated amber cards in here. Um, maybe another space prism, just... Why not? Bit of fun, eh? Uh, you can go up here, just... Keep yourself out of the way, you know. Oh, oh yeah, I think we may have found the, the way this works. Oh, are you doing sweep? You're doing sweep. Ah, oh, you bastard. Uh, fine. It doesn't matter. It genuinely doesn't matter. You were gonna, you were gonna fall anyway because, yeah, you do not do enough damage and I'm doing 44 a time. Yeah, turns out 44 is a much bigger number than 5. Farewell! <laughs> oh, it's just so satisfying when you get that kind of 
nice build. And it's just like, you can do nothing. Uh, consume. Add three uncommon or rare muscles to your hand. I don't like things that give me ember drain. I, I'm just... I object. Also, I've already got lifesteal. And that lifesteal is going to be... Yeah, you know what? Pack morsels. Like, give me more morsels. Mollusk Mage. Offering a tuned. Multiply the effects of magic power by five. You'll see damage to the front enemy and push it to the... Ooh. Maybe? Being said, the Mollusk Mage kind of does something very similar. Yeah, you know what? Stick the Mollusk Mage in. Oh, hello. We've got the Overgorger. And so basically anything of these... Either of these is good. You're really strong straight straight away, and you're going to get progressively more and more strong. Oh, so you're actually going to get four every time you eat. You know what? I think you have the potential to be something very impressive. What have we got? We've got Merchant of Steel, Hellvent, so I can duplicate a card. I think I specifically would want to maybe this like another one of these in the deck would actually be quite nice um and the umbra brana seal caverns don't need help yeah you know what I I actually do think this is quite a fun little card because you can throw it something at the back and it is a lot more straightforward umbra banner oh another one of you oh you're the same thing. Um, I don't need... I feel I'm getting enough morsels through, if I'm honest. But this actually lets me get something on each floor, so... Yeah, let's try that. What's in the concealed cabins? Oh! The blacksmith huddles near the train. She's clearly unaccustomed to the cold. I trust the rail has been smooth. Well, as smooth as it can be in times like these. Uh, right. Well, I found something of use. A couple of relics left behind by my father. I wasn't sure that you'd come by the forge, so I trekked out in this damned cult to find you. I don't have room for them both, but I figure you might have need for one. Hell, I might even be able to upgrade it later if it suits you. Okay, rail spike deal oh i like the i like the extra animation so deal 10 damage and slay at a permanent copy of this card to your discard pile okay cool or the rail driver spike driver colony um multi-strike extinguish at a permanent creeps on oh oh also you're free and if we start feeding you morsels, that would be kind of hilarious. I mean, at worst, you're kind of a nice little death sponge. I already have enough spells that will kill things. Yeah, I say this. F hands over the strange machine. Odd thing, that invention. But if my old man made it, it's sure to work better than any junk you get from the crucible. And if you can get a few more of them, four or more will do. I'll make it worth your while. I really enjoyed a run last time where Hef joined us. So I'm kind of always excited whenever I see Hef on the on the on the on the rail in the concealed caverns. Uh unit center with rage two, Taos attacks every turn and gains armor on slate. Okay, that's fine. I can work with this. But your minions are also quite weak, so I have enough things that can get rid. Uh, 999. Nine, nine. I don't really want to put anything on that bottom floor. I don't really want to put anything on the middle floor, on the top floor. I guess I'll put things in this on the center. Um, that being said, you're doing 12 damage. I think it's doable. You're gonna, you're gonna get life steal. You already have life steal, so you know what? That's not what terrible. Are you not going to attack? I thought you attacked every turn. Or am I just kind of 
Oh, you're going to do 12 damage and then I'm going to heal immediately. Never mind, that's that's absolutely fine. Restore health equal to damage dealt. That is a factor I didn't account for. Cool. Um, yeah, you can go there. Might just keep you around because I suspect the Crucible Collector may not do well. Okay, let's get some morsels in, in play. 7, 7, and 10. Get you out of the way. But you're still going to now do 17, but... 7, 10, but you need 20 attack. Ah, because you don't have it yet. Right, that's fine. Right, let's start setting some stuff out. So... This one, this one, you will need more help than this, um, you having more life steal is a good thing, and honestly, yeah, you having more life steal is also a good thing, and now everything's a little bit more straightforward. Huh, okay. Oh, look, the top floor is made of death. Oh, we got a lot of lifesteal. A lot of damage shield, for that matter. How is this? No, you're still going to die. That's fine, because I have this. And now you're going to gain 16. Uh, I probably want a life steal on. I mean, you have five life steal. Um. Oh, you're already gaining life steal, so you don't need this. You go there, and you can have. Actually, let's have some benefit from you because that also means, yeah, that that's a good idea. Uh. Six, six, eight. So there's no point in putting this out. So that's absolutely fine. Let's just skip. Okay, this is starting to go better. I'm, I'm enjoying... Oh, yeah, this this works. Um, oh, I don't have any ability to... You know what? You can have it. Um, this can go there. Yeah, this top floor just not really a concern. Um, you're a bit of an ass. I could get rid of you. Yeah, you... I mean, you guys will both fall at the top. You're going to lose five. Yeah, I think what I want to do is pop this on you. There you go, and now you'll just go down. And then... Ooh, actually. Put that on you, and then you can just take a lot more damage. That sounds like a better plan. There's no point. There's no point in putting anything in that... Uh... Nice. Okay, liking this. Yeah, turns out it's actually really easy to slay things. <laughs> uh, Ember Cash. Uh, Seven, 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 eight. So twenty-one. So you're actually doing exactly twenty-nine damage right now. Let's have that not happen. Um. Also, let's have you gain a bit more, and then you can also gain a bit more.
Yep, that'll work. Okay, I'm 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 seeing a pattern and it's working for me. Uh, though I don't think it's going to be the best way to do it. Um, hang on, we can do this cleverly. Yeah, you get away. Um, might be able to stop uh, on the second floor. Yeah, why not? Yeah, you'll go down. You'll go down top floor. That. Um. Yeah, there's there's literally no point. You want it to attack in. You know what? I'm kind of willing to sacrifice the, the bottom floor. Like, when you've got that much rage on, it's kind of just... Yeah, it's not going to work. You're not as good as I think you, as I would have liked you to be. That being said, oh yeah, you're going to kill, uh, right, cool. I can at least do this. Um. Sure, why not? Uh, any space for you? Yes. Ah, okay, so you're still going to go down. A uh, bunch of you will, okay, so you attack first? You know what? Gets more of these in my discard pile. Nice. Oh, the life steal. Oh, the life steal. That was just. That was just painful to watch them okay liking that right i think i may have got an idea from what's going on furnace tap apply multi-strike one and ember drain four oh. honest titan apply five magic power spells in hand spike the stygian sap and frostbite i'm actually feeling i mean you know what i don't need that much because most of my units a free anyway. And multi strikes really good. Uh Cold Celia. Apply Frostbite 3 to the attack unit. Encant for must more stuff. Sweep strike apply. Spell weakness to the attack unit. You know what? I'm gonna do it fairly loose. Actually, yeah, light to seraph. Um extra extra space on each floor. Probably not a bad shout. Right, so we have... Ooh, we can kick some things off, or we can get a horde. Is there anything I would like to duplicate? Uh, you know what? Honestly, I think, yeah, Merchant of Magic. I mean, honestly, my priority is just picking up these uh, train stewards because they are not uh, going to help, I don't think. Um, don't need to restore the pyre. And forge my champion. Life steal. Ooh, summon. Oh, you are just going to be the deadliest. Yeah, like, glutton two. That's... <laughs> oh, God, that's going to be so funny. Uh, right, upgrade a spell. What can I make cheaper? Furnace tap. Ooh. What can I... Ooh, I can make Flash Freeze more strong. 13 damage? Yeah, why not? Uh, make you a bit cheaper. Yeah, why not? Do that. Uh, anything that I want to have hold over? Not really. Nah, I'd rather re-roll and see if I can get... Oh, I could remove consume. Um, okay, let's make another thing. Let's make you even cheaper and thus much less of a problem. I don't want to have the search then. I uh, divine temple. I think there's a bunch. Of, yeah, there's divine temples later. I'm on fifteen. 
And I can get in one of these 10, 50, so 25, 25. So I can actually, in, the, in two, I can definitely get to 100. That's absolutely fine. So actually, the fact that I have the Divine Temples in the last two territories means I can ignore everything else. So that is okay. Okay, well, I, do you know what? Let's let's do the battle first. Let's. It's like, ooh, what's in the next? What's in the next ring? It's like, well, why don't you? Why don't you just try and survive this one first? Yeah, non-bosses get plus six. I'm okay with that. Yeah, no, you're not too bad. I'm not much of a. Con uh, yeah, in fact, also, also, also. Your ooh, okay. Well, let's put a strange steward in front of you, um, and let's get rid of you because you're doing the most damage. And also, you can have that. Oh, that'll be fine actually. Yeah. Um. Oh, and yeah, you can have that as well. And we'll pop you on the next floor with that just behind you. Our shadows will live longer than you holy traitors. Okay, you're kind of useless, but whatever. Overgorge up here. Probably going to want... Space Prism up here. Are you going to go down? Good. And yeah, I'm pretty okay with most of this. Yeah, that works. Okay, so you were rid of through the damage shield, but that's fine because you were basically just here to be a life suck. Right, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Uh, so you're going to go down. Can I do anything with this? You get multi-strike. I mean, you can definitely have multi-strike because that sounds hilarious. Uh, can I prevent you from going down? I don't think I can, which is annoying. Because you'll attack, you'll attack, you'll attack. And you'll get... So... We can at least put that there. Can we just try and put Mollusk Mage in front? Yeah, I didn't think that would work. Okay, fine. That's a shame. Very annoying. Incredibly annoying, my word. And that is why we do not succumb to hubris. Oh, I have no heal. I have no healing. Where are all my morsels? <laughs> why are all my morsels at the bottom of the deck? Ah, so this is what... Uh, ah, an ember drain is a bastard. You know what, we can at least do this. Uh, oh dear, 11... Plus seven. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. A brief respite, but to what end? Um, let's at least get rid of you. We can pop you in there. That's... That. Ah, I mean, I guess, you know, there is a benefit. I don't no longer have my, uh... You know what? If the pyre can survive, which it can't, this is going to be really impressive. Oh, you'd have been so good. You would have been so good. 
Yeah, that's... Ouch. It is not my night, apparently. Dear me. I might actually... Okay, I'm leveled up. Making of Morsel, Morsel Miner. Cool. Hell yeah. Uh, the first time each turn an enemy unit dies, add two Morsel units to your hand. Ooh, hell yeah. Cool. Hmm. I mean, I'm making progress on the Melting Remnants. That's at least a benefit. Uh... You know what? I may switch out. You know what? I would like to get the Stygian Guard upgraded. And I think you can do better if I go take them with some rege... Ooh. Or Root Sage might be an idea. Yeah, you know what? Two health is not great in the long run. But extra fight... Yeah, you know what? We're going to try that. We're going to try Tethys. See if we can get him a little bit. Oh, Restoration Destination. I absolutely love. Crypt Builder is a thing, sure. Titan's Tooth is an offering. If Scarlet before the end of your turn, it will instead be played. Ooh. Uh, deal 5 damage to enemy units and apply Frostbite 10. So good if I can get something that's, discard that's discardable. Um, this is the best thing I've got. So I'm really glad I swapped out. The I, I chose to take that. Tethys, 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 what are we going to do to you? So you get Sweep, and Striking applies spell weaknesses to the attacked units. Ooh. Or damage spells cost minus one on this floor. Sweep? Like, something that allows you to... We're we just getting this every time now. Uh, Emblem of the Exiles, at the start of the turn, the front friendly unit on each floor gains five. Do I have any other beasties? No, I have train stewards. Um, this seems like a really good thing. Uh, we're not even going. To, we're not bothering with any of the extras. I'd like to get. I would like to get. You know, reasonably. I would like to get, like to get somewhere. Um, so you'll do three damage. You can take six. Okay, um, we'll pop a train steward in front of... Oh, you're going to... Wait, do you have... Oh, because you're going to have that. Okay, that works. Um, and we'll pop you in front as well. And also, we will... Oh, I could have hit that with you. Oh, that's a pain. Okay, that's a thing. Um, and that's not going to do anything... Because there's not even any benefit to making... Okay, that's fine. Nice, and you now have spell weakness. Your train stops here. So you'll take a lot of damage there. You'll take less damage... Uh oh, right, yeah, that's a thing. Fine, 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 fine. There's definitely a balancing act to be done in this game, which I kind of love. Like, the, 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 it makes a lot of sense. The basic levels of, the basic cards are fairly straightforward to use, and then as time goes by, you end up with slightly more interesting choices. I like it. It's a very fascinating little game. And um, Frozen Lance? Yes, good. Um, not sure I'm winning against the boss, but we'll give it a shot. Oh, everything gets a little bit elfier. Oh, is that non-champion? Oh, front friendly unit, right, of course. <clears throat> so we're going to lose that. Uh... So you get plus two. 
You're also a sweeper. Um, or is it better to do this in earlier stuff? Uh, let's stick it on you. That's a fair amount of damage. You're actually going to do pretty well, I feel. <laughs> But keeping Tethys alive for a while, alive for a while, seems to have actually been a pretty good idea. Okay, so you are going to go down very quick. Uh, five units to enemy. Uh, oh, sixty damage. There we go. That'll work. <laughs> that'll that'll do. That'll do it. Um, Titan's gratitude offering. I don't need another one of those. Um, Titan's gratitude. Yeah, we'll take you. And Steel Enhancer, health and Yeah, it's free, it's health, it's damage. I think that's a pretty good idea. I think I'd like to Yeah, I'm gonna go this way. But I think right now I'd rather get Oh you beauty! I love the Thorned Hollow. The Thorned Hollow is great. Merchant of Steel, what have we got? Uh a unit with quick. 60 max health and also gets spikes more health more damage you know what i'm gonna go uh speed stone we're gonna give you more health so you're a massive tank and yeah i'm not gonna bother putting anything else off because i'm not gonna i don't anticipate keeping many of those train stewards around <laughs> frankly uh, da, 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 da. It's weird that two of my favourite games uh, from 2020 are both about either escaping from or by forcing my way into hell. Because I really enjoyed um, Hades as well. And that's also a roguelike about going through massive things of, you know, through the legions of hell trying to get somewhere. Nice. And also, you can have more power. Blood. Uh, okay, we can just pop. Just drop that on you. Um... <laughs> Oh dear, this is it, so the explo so the so the explosive healing is really fun. Also, you being quick is just kind of amazing. Uh, I don't need any of this. I'll pop you there just to be on the safe side. Uh, you can have a bit more. Oh god, you're gonna get. Are you screwed? Yeah, you're screwed. Okay, cool. That's awesome. Um, oop. Oh god, you're just... You're only down to how? How on earth? Uh, wait, who does a sweep? Who's a sweeper? How are you dying? I'm very confused. Why are you gonna die? Oh, because you have spikes and you'll take... Okay, so you will just lose at some point. That's absolutely fine. Um, okay, that's a shame. You were pointless. And you go down. Yeah, that, that's a shame, but... That is... That'll work. Return boss rush. What is my... Yeah, the, ironically, the spell weakness now is much less of a, a concern. Um, don't want spell weakness. Apply spell weakness to enemy units. I don't want any of these. Go away. Um, razor sharp edge. Apply plus 10 and minus 2. Um, 10 damage to the front enemy. Deal 3 damage. Move the unit to the front. None of those really inspire me either. Actually, maybe raise a sharp edge. Like raise a sharp edge on the um, on the on the thorny boy is probably good. Pyre remains not going to be useful. Duplicate. Ooh, 
every time. Let's duplicate. Oh, actually, no. You know what? First, concealed caverns. Let's see if there's a fancy card that comes in here that might be fun to duplicate. Oh, hello. A fissure in the ice forces the bone shaker to stop. You've seen cracks like this before, often allowing you to multiply your forces through some ancient magic, but this one is different. Unstable. Throwing something into the fissure could have unusual side effects, while just absorbing the energy from afar could have the more expected effect. Copy a card five times, or copy a... Is there anything I want five of? There's definitely nothing I want five of. Yeah, no, I'm just going to absorb from afar. Like, I was already thinking, hey, you're pretty good. We can get you. Even from a safe distance, the energy is almost too strong to endure. But it has intended consequence of duplicating your forces. Uh, I'm not sure if I want to duplicate that. Uh, Cold Celia. You're objectively better now because frostbite is better and let's duplicate so you're three you are two you know what three of you is i don't think i need to get another beastie i think the biggest issue i'm now going to find is that i will run units into with sap one House and tax every turn applies days on strike. That's a pain in it, the ass. That being said, my friends are going to get. Yeah, here we go. Actually, you know what? You there? You there? And you should. Don't you sweep? Why are you not? Why? Oh, because you right, right, right. Yeah, you're a annoying bugger. Ain't even worth it. You know what? It's one extra one dead. I mean, there's an attack. It's just not a sweeping attack. Oh, exactly what we want. Uh... Actually, you know what? This is definitely the better plan. Uh, okay, you're going to go down. You can have a little bit more power. And you can sit up there. Uh, yep, that'll work. Fortunately, I'm not too fussed about being dazed. Because ultimately, your, the point of view is to have, have uh, spikes. Okay, the frostbite we're liking. Huh, that's... Okay, fine, I guess we'll use the Titan's Tooth. Ooh, and you've got spell weakness now. We're going to take quite a lot of damage. I really would like to have some healing. Maybe I should have uh, duplicated the explosive healing. The fact that you're quick is actually amazing because it means that even your dazed doesn't actually matter. <laughs> That's kind of great. Um, cool. Be explosive and now all of you go down. Um, I think we can survive with that. And let's get rid of you as well. And now you'll go down. Uh, so you'll... Yeah, I'm not too concerned about any of this. Yeah, the quick is actually kind of amazing. Quick thorny friends. Quick thorny friends. Oh my word. Um. I just... Yeah, you're not really doing any... Have that. I think the only thing I really want now is more Ember.
More ember and more healing. That is my priority at this point. Where are the explosive restoration? They're probably coming. Uh, oh, wow. You're going to go down. Right. Okay. Um, do that. And stick that on you. And... Oh, and now neither of you die. Cool. Feeling pretty good about this run so far. Oh, wow, the frostbite. The frostbite. <laughs> oh, frostbite. It just... Red pack. Yeah, I might just get an extra bit of ember. Uh, deep offering. Discard your hand. Draw five. Ooh, regen and spikes. Uh, it's got to be. It's got to be. Um, Vine Mother, add a Sting Spell to your hand. Guard the Unnamed. Sting Spell. Ooh, you're quite tanky as well. Yeah, I'm, I'll go for you. Uh, and yeah, definitely plus one Ember per turn. That sounds like a great idea. Uh, right, so Awoken Banner, kick something into the pit. Don't need to heal my... Yeah, this, this way. This way... And spell weakness two is not. Ah, ooh, apply frostbite ten to the attack unit. Yes, please. I think I'll do that. Uh, last stop, lads. Off new way. Um, what's in Herzl's horde? When played, your champion gains plus fifty percent attack. Nice. At the start of battle, draw until you have ten cards. Ooh. How useful is that? When played, your champion gains plus 50%. I mean, Tethys' attack is crap, so yeah, not really worth it. Uh, Husk Hernet has another sweep. You know what? That's not bad. I will go for that. Like, a bunch of sweepers. We've basically now got a sweeper e for each floor. Non-boss enemy units restore all health when they move up a floor. How much? You have 60. You have 30. No, you have 10 with armor 50. You have 35. Oh, and you also the longer you're alive, the... Mm. A random artifact. You know what? I think I can do that. I think I can do that. Uh, ooh, this is a good starting hand. Right, Thorned Hollow. And we'll pop in... I was sure I... Yes, I did. I did see Restoration Detonation. You go down. Uh... You're a sweeper, or you're a sweeper. Yeah, let's put you on the bottom floor. Wait, why are you... Oh, because you're only one. I thought... I was really confused as to why I only had the... I had, Why that had uh, space left, which is because Tethys is tiny. Um, Pop you in there. Everything else can't go on. You know what? You can have that. And now you'll punch this thing in the face. Nice. Mm -hmm. Fear the clipped. Shan't. Uh, yeah, let's quick and put you at the top. Um, yeah, pop you in here. I'm not sure that many things will get off this bottom floor, honestly. Particularly considering the next couple of turns, I expect to see some explosive healing. Okay, you'll heal all the way up, but that's absolutely fine. There we go. Uh, six damage. Five damage and frostbite. Yeah, that'll work. Put you there, and are you going to... Oh, no, you're actually going to be a bit of an annoyance, aren't you? Oh, I'm sure I can work you out on the next floor. I mean, the frostbite's helping. Oh, this is a lovely combination. <laughs> Uh, 
31. I think we can afford that. Stick that on as well. And yeah, pretty happy with all that. Might need a little bit of a consideration here, but I think we can work it out. Again, the progressive frostbite is going to be a massive help. <laughs> that is... How much frostbite are you putting on? Is, are you... How much... No, seriously, how much frostbite are you putting on? I think you're terrifying. Frostbite 10, yeah, that would be... That would be a thing. Um, okay, so you're going to go down anyway. So, a bit of Titan's Gratitude for you. A uh, bit of... Oh, I thought I had the explosive healing. You know what, that's fine. You can have that, and you can have that to do a bit more damage. Oh, don't have space for the Vine Mother. Um, kind of actually want to get rid of Tethys. Um, no, actually, the, the Frostbite 10 is really good. Yeah, and then I just need to have you take a bit more damage at the next... Or you deal a bit more damage and nothing will get to the top floor. I mean, you've only got six spikes. I'm kind of impressed that you've not done... Wow, okay, we're not even gonna... I mean, just because I've got... I've got to do something. I don't feel like I'm contributing something to this. <laughs> Why are you... 18, you're only doing 10 damage. I guess, yeah, you've got to get 74 and you've got... got... Oh, I really should have... Okay. Wasn't sure if that was uh, going to... If he was going to die, I really should have checked that. But that's absolutely fine. I mean, clearly what we're learning here is that the uh, first two runs of this was just a warm-up. Oh, oh, it's the frostbite. Yeah, the frostbite is horrendous. If you're on the... You stay on that... Ooh, jackstraps. Deal two damage between whenever an enemy moves between floors. Yeah, sure, why not? Um, buy sap three. Consume, apply silence. Apply frozen to a card in your hand. This is... Guard a card at random. But... You can probably play with random a little bit. Restore 10 health to a unit and descend it. Restore 25 health. Yes, absolutely. Let's do that one. Um, don't really need the money or the pyre health. Yeah, let's start with the concealed caverns. Who we got? Who we got? Who we got? Ember deposits frozen in place collect around the openings in the ground. A byproduct of the pyre, these energy sources have gone dormant. A closer inspection, what amount of this rubble seems to have something more powerful protruding from it? Well, you could take the protrusion, removing some of the ember deposits and hauling them away from the area would help you to eventually revive them with some power, granting you something later on. Ooh. I can either get the abandoned stave, so, plus one per, car per turn for every two Blight cards in your deck. But I'd also get two Vengeful Shards. Part takes more damage. Or, or, remove the Rubble. Get the Calcified Ember. Get upgraded versions later. I'm intrigued. You remove the Ember Deposits from the pile and place them into the Bone Shaker. They may be a burden now, but they could prove useful later on. The train rumbles back to life, leaving the gro glowing relic behind for another lucky traveller. Yeah, I don't know which one of those I should go for. I always... I, 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 love, I love the choices they give you. Uh, right, you lot, you two, off you owe, off you pop. Bye, ta-ra. Not sure how you upgrade her. Uh, right, what have we got? Focus growth. We can make that less expensive. Anything else that's massively expensive? Ooh, spreading spores being less expensive is a good call. Yeah, I like that one. Um, and also, can we put something... 
So 45 health, but it gets consumed. Yeah, 45 health. And then... Oh. Ah, that was not well thought out. Right, that's a shame. That's a shame. You know what, actually, you know what? It's it's expensive, but I I can actually work with that. Reroll that. Uh, double stack. This does... Status card effects are... Regen 4 spikes 4, sap 6. Plus pay 20. Oh my god, that would be... Worrying. Yeah, you know what? We'll double stack spreading spores. Uh, we'll add something else to be a bit cheaper. We'll make... You know what, we'll make Triton's Gratitude much cheaper. It's, you know, it kind of offsets the fact that you have to discard a card at random. Uh, yep, yeah, that'll work. Not sure that was my most effective play, but we'll work it out. Um, heavy hitting clip warriors, protect the harpy. Uh, enter with armor 15. Yeah, sure, you know what, I'm actually feeling pretty good about my setup. Yeah, not really fussed. Uh, right, Thorned Hollow come out. Uh, how many Thorned Hollows do I have? Um, I've got enough to do a bit with. I've got no... Ah! Perfect. You have lots of spikes now. Oh, also you can have a Steel Enhancer. Yeah, pretty happy with that. And then, presumably, if, I'm hoping a Thorned Hollow will come out next turn as well. Because otherwise, Tethys may just get punched in the face. A Thorned Hollow, marvellous. I have a massive amount of health. Okay, you're not both going to go down. Get that spirit, you. <laughs> and we'll draw an extra card next turn. Oh, I had the dead weight. I really should have... I should have taken that other, that other, uh, the, the save, really. Hang on, what can you do? Nice, and also... Hey, you're looking like you'll get a bit more of a problem. And, to be honest... God, I mean, as long as it's not this one. You know what? Let's hang on. Who's got? Ah, you're doing. You're taking. Nice. Okay, that's what you want. Bit jammy, admittedly, but you know what? It's it'll do. Oh, he's a spiky friend. He's a spiky friend. Yeah, the Thorned is very good. Be pretty cool with that as an idea. Um, I don't really... I'm not sure. I'm going to keep it for the time being. I'm happy with what's going on here. Uh, put you there. And we'll chuck a spear at your face. Oh, I'm actually going to have to put something at the top uh, level. I don't have to put too much on the top level. Juvenate. Yes. <laughs> Annoying thing is that armor is actually being a bit of an ass because uh, I could have got rid of that, uh, the clip shaman. There we go. And we'll do that one as well. 
Yep, that'll do. And... Get Sting in here for the time being as well, just to be on the safe side. Sting! Nice. Oh, you are excellently spiky. Oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, we can make this even better. We can make this even funnier. We can make this funnier. We can absolutely make this funnier. So spiky. You actually deal more damage to yourself than you uh, actually deal to me. Uh, I do love this. I, the, thor the Thorned Hollows are possibly one of my favourite cards. Oh, and you're rejuvenating. Oh, this is... This is just sad to watch. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's so satisfying to see. You love to see it. Oh, my dark spoils are made even greater. A guardian stone. Apply armor one to friendly units. Ooh, that could be quite good. In front of, uh, alongside Tethys. Unnamed tome, because it's only one. Uh, silence, because yeah, we'll go to the Guardian Stone. Because that at least can sit on the same level as Tethys. Uh, deal 10 damage to the front enemy unit equal to 10 times the amount of spikes on friendly units. Oh. Ooh, return. Ah, no, I don't want something that descends thing. Bramble Lash. That being said, I could hilariously... Oh, there's too much going on. Um, right. Do I want to get rid of anything? Do I want to duplicate anything? I'm not sure I do. Um, I, neither of these are great, but at least Merchant of Steel lets me upgrade something. We've got boons. I'll just have a quick look at this. I could just get through this Frozen Lance at this point. Frozen Lance and a Root Seed, I don't think they're doing much. Yeah, you know what? They're kind of... Taking up space at this point. Let's get rid. Get rid. Get rid. And Merchant of Steel. Let's see what you... Ooh. Ah. Uh, no. Large Stone is a terrible idea. Because I'm already a bit pressed for space. Five and ten. Do that. Or... Ooh. I mean, no. That's not worth it. Um... Yeah, husk curl it with a bit more power. Sounds like a plan. Strength stone. Why not? Uh, and then we'll re-roll. Encant armor. Ooh, multi-strike. Liking the... Oh. Everything's useless. Actually, you know what? That at least gives us... Uh, frostbite 6. Like, it's not the worst thing. Um... But I'm not going to bother doing anything else. Don't want to purge anything. Maybe. Might get rid of one of these. Like, I don't think it's... Like, the amount of space it takes up. One's nice. But two... Because we don't have anything that particularly discards. Yeah, I'm going to get rid of one of those. Um... Something with... Ah, give you uh, more health. That might be an idea. Um, also, gain armor. Gain armor when you armor. No, that's silly. Um, this... You know what? You're basically there just to... Keep Tethys alive a lot. Um, what else we got? I don't want to... Temple. Temple... Yeah, let's let's do the. You know what, Arcus, Darkness, Incarnate, because Arcus is a bit of an ass, is a bit difficult. Uh, Looming Dark Shard triggers one of your units dies on this floor. That's fine. Triggers when you play a spell on this floor. So looming is a bit more of a problem than shattering. We will make this work. Arcus, Darkness, Incarnate song is a banger. 
Ah, yes, and we do this. Um, so we have. Oh god, I need to find. Born Hollow. That's Titan Bane. Guardian Stone. Any more of you? Uh, restoration detonation. Um, ooh, an arm. Oh, and that, that armor incanting is already, uh, coming into effect. Uh, you're not attacking, so I might as well put other things out. You know what? It's going to put some frostbite on you early, so why not? And you can have... Yeah, you can have... Oh, no, can't do that. You can have this. Because, again, a bit of armor, why not? Yeah, that frostbite. I'm sure there are very, there are very competent uh, players who can, like, kill the kill the defenders like Arcus without even breaking a sweat or anything like that. Cool. Uh, N times the... Wow, that's gonna be... I mean, I hope this comes out of the, like, the last wave. Like, Brumble Lash ten times... You're going to be quite impressive. It's actually kind of a shame that the uh, the Emblem of the Exiles doesn't trigger Rejuvenation. But what can you do? Uh, so when you play a spell to this floor, that's fine. I don't need to play a spell. Uh, give that to you. Go away. Um... Actually, no, let's let's play everything else first. So let's play Fine Mother. Yeah, Fine Mother. Extra 10, probably not the worst thing. Um, Frozen Lance to your face. Uh, draw extra thing. And Titan's Gratitude. Yeah, now you all go away. <laughs> oh, it's very satisfying. You get that deck that just starts to work, and then it's just like, yes, this this can stay, this can happen. Like I'm still not sure how Seraph is going to go, but uh, we'll make it work. We'll make it work. Uh, so don't let anything die. That's fine. Um, ooh, let me set. Okay, can I? Can we do this? Focus growth. So it becomes pretty hard to. Uh, let's put that there. Oh, this is things immortal. Um. Uh. Let's put this on you, because again, a bit more spikes, why not? And then... I mean, it's a one in, one, two, it's a one in, it's a quarter chance. Let's try it. Let's try it. Oh, wow, okay, that, that happened. Is the game, like, in my favour? I don't know, maybe it just has, like, a little bit of a, hey, we're gonna, we're gonna do a thing, we're gonna, secret, fancy, funny thing, we're gonna, Prioritize the things that discard. I don't know. I'm curious. Not worry about you. Uh, so don't play spells on this floor. Got it. Um, that's fine. I can just place all the spells on the other floors. Ah, uh, that would be nice to. Don't need to do that. I really don't want to do any of that. Uh, spreading spore. Duh, 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 duh. None of this is particularly useful. Uh, uh, let's just see if I can... 
I don't know what goes discarded. It wasn't, it wasn't useful. Fine. Go turn the speed up a little bit. Oh, and you'll actually go down because you are going to be... <laughs> That's kind of fun. And you go down. Bye. Uh, this is... Once something dies, not concerned. Uh, the spreading spores are very useful, but dear me, are they uh, expensive. This isn't the encant one, is it? Uh, to be honest, I might as well just focus right on this one at the start. Because ultimately, I think this is going to be perfectly capable of doing the damage. Like, 25 spikes? You're already on 27 frostbite? Plus you do... I don't know how much damage you do. Yeah, I think you're... I'm going to be interested to see how this works. Dude, that frostbite is really helping. Yeah. Uh. Do that. Um. Do I want to do anything else? Yeah. Again, if this comes out, oh damn it. Oh no, it might. It might because. Okay, draw one next turn. That's kind of what we want. Um, draw one next turn because that's quite useful. Because ultimately, what I really want is Bramble Lash to come out because this thing has hella spikes. Um, and in fact, this is going to work to my advantage on this. We... That's when I play spells, so I don't really want to do that on there. Just in case. Um, eh, that's a shame. Uh, deal 5 damage to enemy units and apply. So, apply plus 1 to spells in hand pass. Uh, well, it all gets discarded, so it's also going to go... I'm drawing seven. So, seven out of 26. I've got about, again, one in four chance of drawing Bramble Lash. There it is. <laughs> Amazing. Uh, do I have any other ways to... Eh, no. 280 damage. <laughs> okay, that, that worked far too well. And so you can... I think he's just... Everything is just damage. Everything's just giving more and more shielding. Yeah, you'll lose 95. This is... It's over. Wow, Arcus. Arcus, Darkus. Arcus, Darkus. Arcus, Darkus. Arcus, Darkus, this was a bad time. You, you, you strolled into a bad neighborhood. Uh, right. Do I want to... So, spikes on friendly... <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Every time. Spikes on friendly units deal plus one damage per stack. Yes, please. Yes, yes. I would love that. Uh, Fell's remorse. More ember. More ember. Oh, hello. <gasps> Similar to before, ember deposits are piled throughout the area. By this time, you see the ice beginning to melt, revealing the more powerful ember beneath. As if influenced by the warming of its related energy, the calcified ember you removed before starts to melt as well, granting you something much more useful to harness along your journey. Oh my word, that is... Oh, free cards, free ember. Okay, I, I'm, I'm happy with my choice. I'm happy with the choice I made. Uh, so Concealed Cabin... Probably going to go left. I, I mean, this gets me a specific, a more specific trinket. Um, I don't think I want to duplicate anything because right now... I'm going to get rid of the Crypt Builder. Like, there's... I think the trouble with the Crypt Builder is it's not very useful um, to me because there's no guaranteed way. 
I don't want to duplicate anything. I would far rather go this way. Get the boon. Go to the concealed cavern. Who's here? Oh, hello. Remains of the once great rail of the covenant litter the landscape. One of the rail spikes still contains some lingering power. You could take it and use it as one of your units or enhance your own magical prowess. So, upgrade a unit with plus 20 and add purge. No thanks. Increase magic power by 20 and add purge. Reduce cost to zero. Reduce cost to zero, you say? Reduce cost to zero and get rid of it. I mean, I'll tell you what. Save this to the... Save this to the final. 160 versus... So that's only 25 damage. Yeah, if I save this to the final boss... Let's do that. You take the rail spike and apply its remaining power. It seems to only be effective for this final use as it disintegrates in your hand. I'm pretty confident I can get to the final boss at this stage. Um, upgrade my champion... Frostbite 20. Uh, definitely. Definitely Frostbite 20. Merchant of Trinkets. What do you got? Boon of the Blacksmith. Pie gets plus 15 attack. Uh, spells get an up upgrade slot. None of these are particularly useful. Each time, the first time each turn a friendly unit is healed, draw one. Uh, when a card of the consumer is played, deal 30 damage. X cost cards. I don't think I have any X cost cards, do I? Um, actually, drawing one, probably not a bad shout. And then, yeah, let's purge a card. Um, I don't think we're going to need... Yeah, where we're going, we don't need... Might be okay, but... Yeah, you know what? I don't need sap. This is... I've not used it. I'm happy with that as a process. Right, let's see. What do we got? So, magic power and piercing. Ooh. Plus 10. Interesting. Ooh, okay. Actually, this could be good. Piercing. Piercing g ignores armor. And it's so that's potentially a hundred, and it yeah okay do that upgrade that. Uh, thirty magic power, fifty health restored, absolutely. And can we engage in a pact? What am I finding is not like the Vine Mother's fine. You know what? Actually, Husk Hermit, you're not doing much. We're going to sacrifice you. And attach you to... That just gives health. No, let's put it on the shard channel because honestly I want that alive for longer. Nice. Uh, let's see how well this goes. I'm feeling positive. I think this can work. Uh, threat level. Enemy enters with armor. I. D What's on the next? What's on the next thing? Uh, Unstable vortex. Merchant magic. Forgotten boons. Merchant trinket. Pyromain. Merchant steel. Hell vent. Money might be okay, but let me see. How much do you? You've got twelve fifty. You've got ten. And you've got 15 and armor 100. So actually, an extra armor 20 is probably not that much. Yeah, go for it. Let's let's uh, let's let's go big, go home. Right, what we got? Thorned Hollow, go there. Uh, Ethis can sit behind you. Uh, oh yeah, Crypt Builder's massively <laughs> fancy now. Uh, focus growth and pop that on you. Ooh, and you just draw. Wait, why do you draw? You know what? Bit more of that. Oh, also excavated amber. Excavated amber? What? 
that's not what you just you just pulled out. Um, in that case, let's put spreading spores on you. And we'll also... I can't play anything else. I don't want to... Okay. Hopefully you don't... Okay, it didn't do the Crypt Builder. We're going to skip the Crypt Builder. Because really, if it gets used as an offering, it will be... Oh, it gets discarded. Oh, it will be played. So, yeah, I'm going to assume it won't. Nice. Oh, yeah, I should probably get something in front of there. Uh, Thorned Hollow down here. Ah, and you can have that. Uh, you can sit behind. And you can have that. So you'll be doing a bit more damage. What else do we want to do? Yeah, plus 10. Why not? And let's give you a bit more damage again. Uh... Yeah, I'm not too fussed about your hundred. Oi, Flyzo, how are you doing? It's been a long while. Hey, Midge, don't worry about it. We, You actually kind of came... Uh, house has been crazy. That is totally understandable. I'll be honest, you kind of came to a fun little bit of a time because I think we're going to get to the final boss and uh, I think it's going to go well. I'm feeling positive. Because we have got... Oh, you had a... Oh, Flyzo, of course. You're in, you're in Germany. I hope everything is doing okay. I hope uh, I hope you didn't lose anything. I hope it all went... You haven't relatives lived for you as long as you have to dig their house out of a mountain. Man, that sucks. I'm really sorry. You also brought a car. Well, I mean, ups and downs. But I hope, uh, yeah, seriously, I hope that nobody, uh, that, you know, you didn't, uh, nobody was too badly affected by the floods in Germany. I hope everything resolves itself fairly quickly. Do what I want to do. Uh, root seeds, pop that on you because I want to draw some more stuff. Hit you because, yeah, that top floor is not going to be doing much damage. Um, you're going to lose minus 60. You're still going to lose 60 off that, so I think that means you're going to go down to about. Love that prospect. <laughs> yeah, what well, gotta say, you'll actually do me a favor if you kill the vine mother. Um We're off to a flying start. Uh you're going to go down. Okay, don't want to play that. Titan's Gratitude. Don't really need to play that right now. More regen and more regen. Anything free? A bit more power, why not? Uh, no, don't do that. Attune Gratitude. You're going to go, you're going to go. Get that. And also take that down and take that down. So at least one of you is going to go down. Pyre can take out both of you. Pyre can take out you fairly quickly. You won't hit too hard. And lucky all damages to your cousin's house look repairable. I'm really glad to hear that. That is, you know, if that kind of thing is going to happen, like, I, you know, at the very least, 
you know, I hope that it's it's not going to harm anybody too much. Nice. Okay, is this the boss wave? No, it's not. Uh, I really want to keep that. That's annoying. Uh, okay. Play that. The heal. Um... Ah, yes. Play that for the extra draw. Um, play that because it's funny. Um, play that for the extra draw. I think that's everything I can do. So now I'm drawing plus nine. So I've got a pretty good chance of drawing the Bramble Lash. Because the Bramble Lash... On something that's got 42 spikes. Bramble Lash. Nice. 420 damage. Um, I, I hate that, that works so well. Um, oh, you're going to go down no matter what. Okay, that's fine. Well, we can still make this funny. And that and that. Because why not? Um, so you lose 56 health, you will get your ass kicked. You basically, you're going to punch yourself in the face to death. I will take that. God, you're taking... Oh, wow, that's... It's taking, it's taking 98 damage when it hits me. Oh, it's... It's getting spell weakness as well, and I think the, the spikes count as a spell. <laughs> oh, that's satisfying. That is very satisfying. Oh, that's good. Uh, offering, apply sap 220 units. Eh, apply frostbite 2. Don't need that. Consume, apply frostbite 6. Yeah, let's do that. Get something free. Uh, draw plus one, possibly. Consume, apply spikes. F you know what? Absolutely fantastic. Spikes four, get more spikes, get more spikes. Uh, Seraph, we're going to punch you in the face. Uh, so, we have Merchant Trinkets, Merchant of Magic, Merchant of Steel. Um, do I have anything that really wants a bit of an upgrade in terms of beasties? Uh, maybe... I think the Vine Mother can go, actually. In that case, Merchant of Magic. Are there any spells? Bramble Lash is kind of full. No? Oh, no, I've not done anything to Bramble Lash. Did I make Bramble Lash cheaper? Ooh, okay. That's... I don't need to duplicate anything. I don't need to restore my Pyre... Let's go this way, and we'll go into the Merchant of Magic. Double stack is pretty good, so upgrade something to be cheaper. We can make... Probably, I mean, Bramble Lush making that cheaper sounds like a great plan. Power Stone, so that can be plus 10, that's not impressive. 20, that'll do. 20 health, I like it. Uh, ooh, double stack as well. Double stack on... Okay, spikes 8 is a good idea. Uh, quickly reroll. Consume. Can I remove consume from anything? Oh, I could remove... <gasps> oh. I could... Nah, but I then it would then still be 2, and I'm not that fussed about it. Uh, this is pretty inexpensive. Actually, excavated ember. Make that cheaper. Remove it. Uh... And upgrade something. Let's just make this free. I really would have liked to have made this... Um, like, just stay in my hand every time. But I don't think that's going to happen. Uh, anything that I want to use once and then get rid of? Actually, yeah. Now that I think about it. One and done removes it from my hand... You know what? Yeah, I'm going to make that deal more damage and get rid of it. 
Because I think that works. I think that works quite nicely. I didn't look at the trinkets. I'm a dumbass. Uh, apply frozen to random car in your hand. Eh. Apply silence when an enemy unit enters your train. Friendly units get plus five. You know what? I'm I, I I'm an idiot. Oh, wait. I might be able to afford something. Oh, oh, you're toying with my heart. Um, silence when you enter the train. Apply frozen. That being said, frozen is removed when the card is played. So I'll get, I don't think it'll... Let's give it a shot. Let's give it a shot. Anything I want to kick out? Um, probably the frozen lances. Root seeds, like root seeds at least have a benefit in that they add to my draw. Yeah, let's get rid of the frozen lances. Remove that. And remove that. And we'll jump into the divine temple. Purge stone. Upgrade a spell and gain purge. Maybe. Maybe. What's the other one do? Upgrade a spell to cost minus two. Ooh, that would do it. That'd be fun. Oh, definitely do that. Uh, let's do this. I've actually got to do everything because I want 100 on, up in this top left corner. Uh, I mean, that already has purge. So, that'll make it... Oh, that would not do anything to it. Fine. Um... And to be honest, at this point, it doesn't really matter what happens. Um, this being purged doesn't matter. So it's cheaper. I use it once, and then it goes away. Or I use this, and it's free. Oh, that's already free. Um, yeah, you know what? This doesn't really do anything. Like, I want Frostbite w once, and then... Yeah, I'll, I'll take it. I'll take it. And that's the best. And I think... The Vine Mother is going to be eaten. Wait, no. Don't you... That causes drawing one. You... Yeah, you know what? The Guardian Totem is not as useful as I'd like. Uh... Oh, you actually... This actually causes you to lose health? Okay, well, then you can have that. That sounds like a terrible trait. But okay, we'll we'll put that into there. And Seraph the Temperance. Okay. It's either going to be very good or very rough. Um, and if we win this... I get to have the fancy uh, final battle. So, Prideful Emblem, uh, Friendly Unit Center with Sap 3. Do you know what? Actually, that's not a big deal because I'm actually relying far more on spikes. Spikes and spells. Spikes and spells. So, what are you going to do? So, multi strike. Oh, right. You just have multi strike. Uh. Each point of damage blocks one point of damage. Wow, so your thing is just multi-strike and you sap my strength. Oh, and you bring people onto the top. Fine, fine, fine. Uh, sure. Not overly concerned, honestly. Uh, also, please to explode now. I got more... Yeah, that's going to do a lot more damage. Uh, let's stick you at the top. Uh, oh, actually... I, wow, okay, so my entire plan is pretty much already set up, so that'll do. Um, do I want to put Frostbite on you? There's not really any downside to putting it on early. You still just take the damage. Uh, oh, and you get armor. That's right, that's a thing. I forgot about that. Um...
Oh, and you have some spikes on you. So, and then when I play this, I'll discard this, and you'll have even more frostbite. Oh, excellent. Oh, this is off. We're off to a very good start. Oh, this is going to... Something's going to go horribly wrong. Ah, oh, I feel something's going to hor go horribly wrong. I'm concerned. Uh, okay. This is a... This is a start. Um, am I going to lose all of my, all of my guys? You're quick, so can you take anything out? Oh no, I may just be out to lose this floor. Um, oh no. Ah. Oh. Hubris. Hubris. Is what we're dealing with here. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. <laughs> Um, right, so my Frostbite 20 lads are uh, not going to do so well. Yeah, because 8, then 10, then 10. So yeah, you're not going to get a chance to strike. Right. Yeah, that's that thing. That sure is a thing that happens now. Okay. Uh, oh, can I even... Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, right, okay. We're going to have to heavily invest. Uh, that husk hermit's pointless. Do I even have... No, that husk hermit is legitimately... Not going to do anything. I desperately needed that husk hermit to come out when Tethys was still alive. Okay. Right. Right. Okay. Thing on you. Uh, that's not actually as useful as that will be. Um, don't want to just got a card at random. Actually, two of these are actually not the worst thing. Um, you know what? No, I just don't want to. Um, right. A bit more damage on you. I don't want to do that because I want to make sure I'm hitting that 160 on Seraph himself. Are you going to go down? Oh, God, you're not. Uh, don't get rid of the Crypt Builder. Oh, thank goodness. Right, okay. He's feeling under control. Not as it's not as under control as I'd like it to be, but it's uh, yeah, it's a thing. Okay, so the sting I can get rid of here. Uh, Bramble lash is good here. Bramble lash is better here. Um, Bramble lash is even better now. Bramble lash is free, in fact. That's good. Uh, let's put a bit more damage on you. Um, let's put a bit more... Let's just put some... Da have you do some actual damage? Why not? Um, I definitely want to draw stuff. And then, yeah, let's... Oh, wait, no. 220. You're going to lose a lot of health anyway. Is it better for you to lose 220? Oh, no, because that's only 60. Okay, get rid of you. That root seize is now frozen. Four waves. I think we could do this. Right, what level are you on? Where are you going? Are you on the top floor? No, you're not. You're an annoying, tedious bastard. And full. Oh my god. Ah, right. Don't play that yet then. Uh. uh what do I want to do? Um. Play the sting. 
You do have health to grow, so... Nice. Draw an extra one. Uh, oh, that's actually not helpful. Um, I think this still counts... Because I still get spikes. Um, oh, I can't play this now. Uh... Okay. Didn't lose the thing that I need to keep. I'm assuming that I won't... Assuming the dead won't, won't get frozen. Oh, that's exactly what I wanted. That's perfect. Okay, the frostbite is good. How are we doing up on here? So you are going to lose less than we'd like. So, excavated amber. Uh, restoration... Okay, that's going to do some damage. Ramble Lash there would be good. 100. Yep, that'll work. Uh, and also... Don't want to do this thing. Ah, yeah, actually, because that means you'll get the full brunt. There we go. Um, what else do we want to do? Uh, we've got the capacity to do another sting. We've got the scope to... Have you got any regen? You have got regen, and you've got regen, but you can have a bit more regen. Um, frustrating thing is that right... Oh, wait, you know, you have a bunch of health you can get, so that'll do. Uh, another one, so I'm going to draw even more. Uh, if it looks by any chance like I'm flailing and just hoping for a series of good hands... Uh, you'd be right. So you do 40, you're going to do 42 damage. You're going to do a little bit of damage to there, so that's okay. You're going to get quite a bit. Okay. Two waves. Okay. I have no honest clue whether this I win this or lose it. Um, it's all a bit... Uh, yeah, I've not really got a Scooby. Uh, you can't actually... Okay, right. You can take a bunch of damage. And also, what's z what zero cost stuff? Uh, you can go, and you can go, and you know what? Actually, this seems to be the time to use that. It's a bit of a shame to use it there, but whatever. Uh, 45 plus 2, 45 plus 2. Um, you're going to go down. You are now going to go down. Um... Titan's Gratitude, discard a card at random, so anything I don't mind discarding. Um, you've got a lot more health, so we're going to put some... Actually, we're going to put some damage on you. Um, I can either restore. That also allows me to get plus two health, and it's not going to spread more stuff in here. Because uh, I think this will still get me spikes if I'm right. So, currently on 43, now on 46. Perfect. And let's just quickly throw that there. Uh, just for... Okay. Ooh, nice. A lot of crossbite. Have you broken... No, I've not broken 2,000 yet. This is the final wave. Oh, dear. Well, this is... Concerning. Okay, so restoration detonation. That's a good start. Uh, sting. So you're not going to do a huge amount. Um, we start. Wait, what do you do? What's your thing? Harvest. Apply armor 15 to this. Okay, so you're actually not a problem. Um, let's do everything else first. Yeah, 14 times 2 is better than 18. 
Let's hit you. Let's hit everything that costs zero. And I also want to make sure... So you've got regen, you've got regen, so you can both still have some regen. Um... Oh, is there anything that makes me draw more next turn? I'm already on seven, so I'm pretty okay with it. Um, let's also... You know what? I think this is a good call. And then we'll finish off with that. So now you're nearly dead. You will go down. Um, you're going to just lose 21 health. So you're going to lose a lot of health over time. And you're going to be hitting 56, 10 times 4. So you're actually going to do about 100 damage to yourself. Okay. I think I've got one more. I think I have one more turn of prep. Because you're going to freeze this. Right. You're going to only use a thousand. That is not enough. Um, so you're going to have to go away. So anything that's cost zero right now is just going to be... Okay, I need that to hit elsewhere. Um, I really wish this had some form of trample on it. Uh, restoration detonation... <laughs> That's a good start. Restore 45. Okay, we got another sting. Um. Oh, you're losing more health. That's good. Restore 40 health. That gives you a bit more. You lose a little bit more. Um, you can have a bit more damage. Honestly, I kind of just hope, because you've got 65, you've got 230. Um, yeah, I'll be honest, my big hope is you get hit with the Frozen. Not what I wanted, but fine. I think I can do this. Oh, the regen's going to make you more powerful over time as well. Yeah, that Frostbite is doing a world of good. Okay, I really need... Okay, Sting. <gasps> 801. I think with this Sting, I do it. Oh, amazing. I'm still going to get as much stuff on here as possible, because fuck you, but... I've only done what Herzl couldn't. By any chance, did Herzl fall upon his own sword? Because that is the only thing I see you doing, Seraph. Wait, shit, I've got another match. I've got another fight after this. Oh, oh no. Right, I've just realised I, I I may have set myself up for an even bigger fall. Uh, oh. Uh oh. The last divinity. Oh no. Either in victory or defeat, the divinity's endless destruction rages on. Two thousand five hundred. Okay, I can do that. Uh, after a debuff deals damage to this unit, remove that deal debuff. Oh no, that's all of them. That's my frostbite. Uh, the last divinity has different status effects on each floor and gains seven fight when it gains relentless. Okay, that's not terrible. That's okay. I think I can do this. I hope. I've actually probably got one of the best decks that I've had. What the f-
Oh, uh, wait, what? Oh, you... It's on all floors. It doesn't move... Fl what? What? You motherfucker. Oh, that's not fair. Okay, this this gotta be a thing. This oh dear. Oh, this gonna be a thing. This gonna be an entire thing. Um Okay, okay. I can see through the cracks in my existence, light through glass. Is it meant to fade? Hold you, mate. Fuck off. Okay. <laughs> Oh god, you have trample on this one. Right, so that 2500 was a goddamn lie. So you have trample on this level. You have multi strike on this level, and you have sweep on this level. Right, okay. Okay. Oh, you. I disapprove of this entirely. So I'm kind of just getting my setup as good as I can, really. Oh, I can start just throwing stings at you, can I? That's going to do nothing. That's going to do 170 already. Um... Okay, that Bramble Lash is getting tasty already. Um, got eight waves remaining. What happens? Like, how does this even work? Like, does he shrink down to become relentless? Does he just attack every floor at once? Um, I don't know. This is an entire thing. That frostbite is not as uh, fun as I would like. What the hell are you? Overcharged tank. Well, at least you're honest. Can I just get rid of that thing in the front? Right, yes, sting. Go away. Go away. <laughs> Oh, you harvest as well. Okay, that's fine. Oh, actually, yeah, I should use Titan's Grass up here, shouldn't I? Uh, okay, cool. I'll be honest, I'm, my, my biggest concern is actually my middle floor, of all things. Uh, yeah, I'm going to need to... Like, I think the bottom floor is kind of in hand. I might need to start putting stuff just in the middle. Wait, you're a goddamn boss. 
That's not fair. Right, let's get some focus growth on you. Uh, and also that. Um, sting Steel Enhancer. Why the hell not? Uh, spreading Spores. Oh, gain one extra. Yep, that's fine. Uh, lots of Stings. Bunch of Bramble Lash. That's probably a good call. Um, put that on there. And then basically all the Stings can go on you. Um... Wait, hang on, is this... That's 3,000... Oh, wait, is this cumulative? Okay, so they're currently all the same. I'm going to check and see if they're all the same in a second, because if that's the case, we're in with a shot. Cause... So 295. 295. Okay, right, okay. That is a... That is a... Uh... Right, it's not three lots of 3,500. It's... It still sucks, but oh my... Wait, what? Oh, Vengeful Shard, whatever. Oh, you, you're you nothing. Uh, you know what? I, like, honestly, possibly worth it. Um, you can have 50 health, sure. Actually, no, you can have 50 health because you... Yes, that'll do 250. Nice. Uh, you... Are about 20 away, so yes, you can have that because that holds you fully. Um, we're gonna pop this on. We we'll start putting this on you. Um, we're not gonna bother with spreading spores right now. Uh, we will throw this sting at you. Um, we will throw. So that's 37. That's 19. That's only three. Probably worth starting on this. Um, that being said, uh, you know, you know, actually, you know what, play that, f play this first, because then, hell, they, if that gets discarded, then it's no longer in my hand. Uh, possibly could have used focus growth, but that's fine. Um, draw one next turn, I'm already drawing one, that's fine, you know what, let's, let's do it, and we'll get rid of that, purge that. That purged, right? Oh, no. That just... Oh, so that's just going to be there forever. Oh, well, I'm glad I got that... Killed that arsehole first. Okay, the spike damage is definitely starting to work. You're down by about... You're down by over a thousand. Oh god, they, a bunch of you got multi-strike, I think. Okay, well, this is an entire bag of dicks. Uh, oh, perfect, that sting can just literally take the sting off. Uh, cool, bramble lash at your face. Um, oh, ha, ha, ha. All you're going to go down. Is there any healing? Is there any healing? You probably need some healing. So we'll pop you on there. Actually, most things are now cheap. So you get a bunch of regen and some more spikes. You have spikes. You have all of the spikes, so I'm not too concerned. Uh, you can have a bit more health. Why not? Um, you can have more health and more damage. Um, you're going to go down. You're going to go down. So, in fact, you're just going to get some stings so I can draw more cards next turn. Are you actually going to go down? You you might. Huh, that's interesting. So the frostbite is definitely helping. The spikes are definitely helping. I'm not liking the multi-strike. I don't like the multi-strike. That being said, I think... I've got good chance of it being... I've got good chance of explosive... Oh god, you are... Uh... You are a bastard. Are we all, are we lost multi strike on this? No, you're just a trample now. That's fine. Cool. That's that's good. That's good. That's good. 
Uh, right. Oh, activated the ambush. Roll up. A uh, lot of spreading spores. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Um, our little hen's going to be... You know what? Actually, probably best just throw the stings away on you. Uh, sting and sting and sting. Uh, and also... No, don't put that on there. Do that up here. And add that again. Because you doing 27 times 2 is a good plan. Uh, you have regen. You don't. You do. So we're going to get uh, one of the spores. Nope, not on that floor. Spores. And vengeful shard. Just get it rid. Okay. Ooh, you're down to 1,000. You're, you're under 2,000. We've got three left. We've got three rounds left. I need to get as much spikes on everything as possible possible you have 17 spikes we have another sting breeding spores is going to be good that works you'll attack a bunch yeah you have a bunch now oh and of course because spell weakness yes right not too concerned i think there should be restoration detonation excellent perfect Explode. Um, what else we got? We got a bunch of stings. Uh, throw it at you, I guess. Bramble lash. <gasps> Bramble lash. One seventy or three twenty or five hundred and twenty. So a really good start. Um, can I get others? Are there any stings? Any other stings? No. Okay. We can get rid of this. We can get rid of not much. The Bramble Lash is... Right, you know what? Bramble Lash is more useful up here because it's still doing more damage. Uh, da, 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 more damage. In fact, you can have that. And then you have... Who's got the least... Who's got the least spikes, honestly? Uh, you have the less spikes. And also... You have fewer spikes? You have fewer spikes. Yeah, that makes sense. There's a logic to my madness. I promise. Uh, I'd like to beat this the first time. It would be really nice if I could, but I'm not convinced. That being said, a thousand is doable. Two waves. None of you are worth it. Um, right. Oh, God. If I could get rid of one of you quicker, that would be so good. Uh, focus growth, actually. Not explosive, but it is better than nothing. Uh, all of you are going to go down. Um, you're not, so priority is you. Nice. Now you'll go down. Uh, Vine Mother is going to die. That's a shame, but I guess you were just giving me stings, and now I've got a handful of the bastards. Hmm. Uh, Bramble Lash. Pretty good here. Thir 390. You're going to go down. You have a We have a straight shot here. Yep. Bramble Lash. Oh, I might do it. I might do it. Uh, nothing's gonna die here except the Vine Mother. I'm okay with that. Razor Sharp? I mean, honestly, yeah, I, my damage is not, my damage output is not a priority, really. Uh, drawing two, drawing an extra one is good. What's got the least spikes? 58, 58, 24. Yeah, the, the Vine Mother going down is a shame, but I think I can just about do this. Seven twenty. Ah, but he's about to become relentless. But he's only got five hundred. This is not the end. 
Now you're relentless. Oh my god, I'm going to win. I didn't suggest that I'm going to win. Let's double check this. Where the hell am I? Where are you? Uh, let's get rid of that, because we'll just minimize the amount of damage my shot's taking. Uh, I mean, I guess, like, yeah. Thing. 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 And I guess I just use the rest on... Spreading spores, I guess. Why not? Uh, you got 65, 42, 31. Cool. Oh, of course. Wow, that sap is actually really doing some... Ah! Well, okay! Facing the last divinity for the first time. I guess this time I truly saved hell. Ooh, and Covenant 3. Nice! I'm pretty sure that's high score. Covenant rank, rank 3. Major battles now have additional enemies. Um, hell yeah. And also, like, a bunch of stuff gets all gold and fancy. That is really cool. Oh, and by defeating the Lisfinity, I've also got a special stamp. They get, like... Oh, wow. I love the fact that the cards get little badges of honours. And, yeah, Stygian's Unlock Siren Song. Pyrebound. Can we play in the fire? Okay. Ascend enemy units on this floor and apply Days 3. Nice. Uh, spell weakness to two enemy units. To, spell weakness two to enemy units when they enter the room below the pyre room. Nice. And soul guard the martyr. You unlock the exiled champion for this clan. You can now choose to start runs with this champion and their starter card. Interesting. Uh, yeah, that's cuddle hex. Oh, it's so cute. End of turn. Apply frozen to a random card in your hand. That'll do. Uh, Tethys Scales, 50% chance to apply Spell Weakness 1 when an enemy unit enters your train. Cool. And, oh wow, Wind Streak increased, Spike Supply. <laughs> oh, amazing. Oh, I did not expect that. That tickled me more than I thought it would. Um... Oh, sorry, that just uh, tickled me because it's Spike Supply is nearly double my previous best. <laughs> oh, that's great. I love that. Remaining coins. I didn't realize you got a, a remaining co a remaining coins bonus. Um, I'm really curious what this new thing is. What do you do? Soul Guard the Martyr. Incant gains Shard 1. Shard powers Soul Guard the Martyr's abilities. Right. Apply Frostbite 6 to the front enemy unit. Scarred a card at random. Ooh. So, Gun power. Like. Powers short. Oh, God. This is going to be ridiculously complex. Um. Okay. That's fair. So, we were not able to um, get very far with the Umbra. I'm wondering if we were to go through, like, Awoken? Like, Awoken have been a lot of fun. Um, and do, like, lots of restore and healing. Um, but I think that is going to be for a another night. So I'm just going to quickly go and find if we can find someone to raid. Rage? Raid. Oh, good lord. I am in, uh... I am... Oof. It's been a long and exciting night. Uh, that is... I'm really... Like, this game is consistently just so impressive. I... I'm absolutely enamored with it. It's so good. Uh, we've got... Uh, you know what? Lillen. Uh, we've, we've raided Lillen before. I'm gonna raid Lillen again. 
because they are, in general, a good egg. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching. This has been an absolutely phenomenal run. Um, I'm really happy with how this has gone. Uh, we're coming to the end of me playing... Oh, actually, there's a thought. Uh, how are we doing on dead enemies? Hmm. It would be really nice before we bid farewell to Monster Train. Disembark Monster Train, you might say. Um, if I could unlock the final clan. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to, but it would be kind of cool if we could. Um, but yeah, I'm going to play Monster Train again on Thursday. And then I'm going to play it again on Saturday. And then... Uh, something I don't usually do, I'm going to stream on Sunday, uh, 1st of August, we are starting Wargust, uh, when I will just be playing lots of Warhammer stuff. Uh, and I'm looking forward to that, largely because I really like that pun. Um, it seems fun, honestly. Yeah, it, Monster Train is absolutely stunning. Um, like, there's a lot of love that's clearly been put in, um, up to and including, like, the music's great, the fact that you've got six clans, um after you buy the DLC, the fact that there's such a variety. And then you go into the logbook and... Uh, let's look at the cards. Every single uh, card has a piece of lore attached to it. Every one of the artifacts has a piece of lore attached to it. Um, yeah, honestly, the, 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 the amount of love that is put into it. Like, I, I love Slay the Spire. I, I was ve I would have been very surprised if I could actually... Um, if I could get something that, that so exceeded Slay the Spire. And this has really done it. Because, like, there's just so much more. I also quite like the fact that uh, there's... You're not kind of having to play cards. And then you just have kind of dud turns. Because... Even if you don't have cards in your hand, you at least have beasties on the field who are going to be doing something, and your you know your your health is at the top, and so it's kind of there's kind of like that really nice combination of slay the spire, roguelike deck builder, but then there's also a bit of tower defense in there, um, which is really fun. I, the, I like I I highly recommend this game. Um, it's kind of interesting just to learn and play and find out more about. So, yeah, I, I highly recommend it. Um, I'll be playing it again on Thursday and also Saturday. And, uh, yeah, then we will move on to Total War Warhammer 2. Um, if anybody has not contributed to the poll that is currently attached to the top of my Twitter uh, there is a, we're basically asking whether you prefer me to play Dark Elves, Lizard Men, or, uh, what was the other one? I know that Lizard Men are winning. Yeah, Dark Elves, Lizard Men, or Tomb Kings. That's it. Um, but yeah, we're going to go over and raid Lillen. In the meantime, thank you very much for watching this evening. I have been Loxley. This has been, uh, this has been Monster Train. We are one step closer to the on the track to 100. Thank you very much uh, to your liege one. Um, and yeah, you all have a great evening. Ta-ra.